Welcome to Draw Class, the show where we teach you how to draw things. I'm Nathan. I'm Jacob. Caldwell has already begun his Thanksgiving uh, vacation, so he's gone. He's gone. He's out. He's, he's out of here. Uh, I, I put on uh, all of his clothes. And I'm, I'm dressed like him. You always put on, you always dress like him. I put on a name tag that said Caldwell, and uh, this is me for the next week. So w today, we're teaching you guys how to draw assorted meats, suggested by Ice Cream Bar. Um, Which you know, I, I, I like to think it's a real ice cream bar. Yeah, who just wants to know how to draw, like, other food, starting with meats, because, I mean, those are the best ones. Yeah, he's good at, like, ice cream bar portraiture, like, drawing his ice cream friends and stuff like sure. that. Sure, yeah. But, you know, he just wants to know how, how the meats do it, how the meats get it done. How does the other half live? The other half being meat. Because those are the only halves of, of food. The it's answer is meat, so so meat tasty. And ice cream. So uh, I just started drawing a little a uh, little little bird. Could be a turkey. Could be a chicken. Who knows? Uh, so it's uh you just you wanna you wanna draw some some curves. It's a nice curvy bird. Draw like a nice little arc up top. It's not a perfect circle. It's like a football with it's, limbs. It's like a football with limbs. Like that, you know, because football is very popular to do uh, around Thanksgiving. To, it's on the TV. But I think that's partially because, like, turkeys have a lot of football elements. Like the drumsticks have, have yeah. like, sort of football shape to them, too. It's like a bunch of footballs stuck together. And uh, you and I well know that, like, big-time football fans will refuse to eat anything that's not shaped like a football. Yeah. It's just you're eating it, and it ma it's making you think, you know what? I could throw the old pigskin around. Throw the old turkey bird down the football court. <laughs> down the football court. We know about sport. <laughs> and then, yeah, you just, you know, get get a little get a little shading on there. You know, it's probably a butter ball, so it's nice and, like, mm, nice and glossy. Oh, man. Just, like, get that sheen on there. It's just, like, dripping, dripping with, with those juices. Can you get some drips? Oh, yeah. Let's Can get, I get a drip? Can we get some drips? I need to really feel the juices on yeah, this one. Yeah, here we go. This is like a nice juice. It's no, none of that dry meat. It's just like sweating. No, this is one of those rare, perfectly cooked turkeys. Mm-hmm. Just like... Moist and delicious. Just like mum used to make. All right. Uh, so that's a turkey. Or chicken. Whichever. Wh whichever you prefer. We're going to say it's a turkey for now. Um, Jacob, what are you drawing? Oh, wait, I'm going to do... Uh, let me get you back to 100. Here you go. I'm gonna do a ham here. Okay, good. We good. Got, We're covering our bases. We, we got poultry. Gotta get all the holidays covered too. Like, I don't know if you do ham at Christmas time. Well, but, I'm Jewish, so. So you don't do anything at Christmas. Yeah, time. we don't do anything at Christmas time, and technically aren't supposed to do ham at any time. At any time, no. But um, uh, I, you know, I, I, I like the, I like the, the fruit of the pig, as I like to call it. <laughs> the fruit of the pig. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I'm partial to to bacon. I like bacon uh, on yeah, things. Yeah, who's not? I like ham. So uh, you're, you're drawing, you're drawing like sliced ham or like a whole like. This is gonna a be hock, a like whole a, like a ham hock. Holiday ham hock. Uh, they're super easy to do. Mm. You just do like a like a circle for the the part that's where it's been cut. Like a, like a flattened out circle to yeah. indicate uh, depth. Then just it's just kind of like a everything that is a meat is just kind of like variations on like a big chicken leg in different yeah. ways. It just it's, this is just like a big thick chicken. It leg. It looks like a half of an hourglass. Yeah, it's and got a got a bone down here. That little bone. To Kinda make looks a like bone, a, like a ham fish right now, actually. Yeah, we didn't uh, we didn't mention that uh, you know you get because meat is um, not a lot of people know this. Meat is actually just uh, cooked animal flesh. Really. And uh, a lot of that uh, has bones because animals have bones. Meat is cooked animal flesh. Yeah. Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> I I've been you eating knew. it this whole time. I had no idea. <laughs> I thought you knew. Do the, are the animals okay? <laughs> No. Did what? <laughs> no, man. Did somebody kill them? They're real. They're super dead. Holy shit. They're super dead and also, like, probably treated poorly. At least I in America. Oh, no. Like. That's rough. Caldwell went to Ireland. We're, we're monsters. Which is where I was. And, like, all the all the food there, like, all the, the beef is, like, grass-fed. Is it like Ooh, really, really you delicious? Got like a slice just sort of falling off there. Yeah, this this is a little extra, little extra yeah. tidbit for you guys here is how to do the slice. You can draw the ham first, then just kind of erase the parts you don't yeah, need. Yeah, and then just like get like a and nice. You can just get ooh, a that's nice a thin, thin slice. Get a nice little that's, slice. That's gonna melt right in your mouth. A little slice going on right here. Uh, 
but yeah. slicing right off. Mm. Can't can't recommend Irish beef enough. It just it tastes. The, I saw so many cows, and they all just looked super happy. What is that? Is that some like? It's fat? just like some fat, some marbling. Some marbling. Ooh, good, good call, marbling. Yeah, you want to get, you want to get some of that in there. Some, some lines. That's like an advanced technique. Yeah. Like that's so this, like this ham. We're gonna get some drips on here too. Really, really delicious. Like anime food always has good marbling. It just always like does. Steam yeah. Steam coming off of it. If I could live in an anime world and eat anime food all the time, yeah, that would be a dream come true. It it looks so much better than our food. It does. It's not fair. <laughs> Why can't all food just be glistening all the time? Because even if I, I get hungry and order the thing, it's not going to be as good as it looks. Oh, that is that's just like a delicious ham. All right, I'm it's gonna just like floating. Give it back to you here. Okay, cool, cool. So we we've, we've got we've got uh, poultry, we got pork. So I'm gonna I'm gonna bring us home some red meat. I'm gonna give oh, us yeah. give us a nice a nice T-bone steak. Oh man! So to start off that, you just sort of draw like a like a melty triangle, <laughs> and then you're you're gonna want to draw like a gross pizza slice, like a gross shape. a gross thick pizza slice, and then you're gonna want to draw your bone right there in the middle. That's that's that T. It's going at an angle because uh, this steak is like on a plate, and then yeah, just make it as thick as thick as you want, just like a nice thick you can go. salad. That's, that's a really thick one. Yeah, dude. And then again, you can get some like some some uh, some grill marks going on there. Oh uh, yeah, that's how you know it's been on a grill. Some grill marks. I don't like those. Sad. I don't like how I did those. It's it's been on two separate grills, according to your grill marks. Yeah, let's just do two separate grills at different angles. Yeah, let's just do the one. Yeah, there you go. There just we like, go. Yeah, get some nice grill marks on there. Some some sizzle. Some that's nice. sweet sizzle. And then uh, yeah, you're gonna want some some more like drips and uh, I don't know if we're like exp it's just it's just squiggly lines uh, the real key of... I think the real takeaway here is drips if you're gonna draw meat make sure you get a lot of drips get a lot of drips Look in there it's gonna there. it's gonna just mm, 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 mm. that's just like a tasty tasty steak it's, uh, getting real hungry here yeah we're gonna we're gonna grill us up some some meat patties and we're done uh, Thankfully, if you draw something, you can you can then consume it also, if you're a good enough artist. Yes, uh, one we're of not those pro level tips. We haven't reached uh, the the art mancy state of uh, of art where we we can materialize our, our drawings, but yeah. we're, we're getting there. But Caldwell has. Yeah, Caldwell uh, actually it was it was crazy. He drew the airplane that he was uh, leaving on, and then he just got on it. <laughs> he just hopped in it and flew right out and the window. It just like left a huge hole in the office. But um, I, I forgive him. Yeah, because that was that was super cool. Was that sausage? Yeah, we're gonna get some sausages. Cool. Uh, down here. To draw um, a sausage, just draw like a pickle. Draw like a pickle, <laughs> or like an elongated bean. Yeah. Uh, any, anything like that, really. Sure. And and the key is, it's really just like a fat hot dog with these little things on the yeah, end. Yeah, you got the because that's the intestine tube. That's the intestine tube. That's, there's another they fun tie, fact. They tie them off. It's all intestine tubes. It's ground up intestines inside of an intestine tube. We're gonna get a we'll get a couple of sausages. A couple here. sausages in there. Yeah. Sure. And we'll we'll give them some sausage shine. Don't worry. I know you were worried. Oh, I was super worried because sausages they can get real shiny. Yeah. You you were thinking I invite Jacob on the show and he's not gonna do the sausage he's shine. He's not gonna give me that that sausage sign. Sausage. Sa sausage. Sausage shine. Sausage shine. The sausage shine. Welcome to draw class. We uh, <laughs> can't pronounce. We fail to say uh, easy words. What's going on with that shine? You got it. There we go. Took you a sec. It's, it took me a sec, but I'm but I'm there. I'm with it now. Mm. Oh yeah, those are. There we go. Some mm. plump, juicy, delicious meat. But but wait a meat second. Meat logs. Uh, we got to get the drips. You got it. <laughs> drippy. Oh, man. A nice wet sausage. <laughs> Nothing Everyone, quite like a nice, just when, dripping wet sausage. Sunday nights when pops would just fire up the old grill and throw on a couple of wet, wet brats. Mm-hmm. Mm, yes. What What are they wet with? I don't know. Just That's a mystery. Sausage water. Sausage water, which you can drink, by the way, also. Mm-hmm. If you're ever, uh, you know... On the go, you want to get your meat fixed, but like you don't, you don't have time to chew. 
Just drink, <laughs> just drink some sausage water, dummy. Just take that sausage water and bring it with you. It's like <laughs> gogurt for meat. Well, I think uh, there's only one thing left to do. Oh yeah. Uh, with with this meat, this delicious meat is um, we need to combine it. Combine it Voltron style. Yeah, because one meat is good, but like, have you heard of a turducken? I have, yeah. Isn't that where, like, a turkey and a duckin love each other very much? A turkey and a duckin? <laughs> yeah, a turkey and a duckin. <laughs> and they, uh, they, they get together. And I'm after... now just trying to imagine what a duckin is. <laughs> it's like a duck, but cuter. It's just like a cuter little duck. Yo, what's up? I'm a duckin. But they also have very deep, masculine voices. How do we, we want to do Let's put it, like... Put it up like that. Oh man, are you gonna have like sticking out of the? Yeah, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna fuse them. Like this is just this is the preliminary. This uh, is step one. This is also the reason why uh, why digital art is is awesome. Digital art is so good. Cause you can just draw stuff and then you can just put it all together. You don't even have to redraw it. Yeah, it's look great. at these look at these drips going going every which way. Oh, he's got little sausage arms. Yeah. It's an anti gravity. <laughs> an anti gravity meat golem. This is a meat golem, uh, guys. If you if you have enough assorted meat uh, and you're not making a meat golem, that's on you. You that, gotta you, you gotta live with yourself. You gotta you gotta do that. Because I'm not gonna. I live guess with the you. the drumsticks can be the arm on that side. So this will just be sort of like the base, right there. Oh, now, I, I uh, see. I like uh, where this is headed. Now let's let's just sort of take this. Yep. And we're gonna. <laughs> <laughs> the the ham flap kind of looks like a little mouth. Uh, talking up there. It does. We're gonna use that. Oh, his little gonna, flappy, his little happy flappy here, hand mouth. We're gonna give him. These are his eyes. Now, <laughs> the marbling his eyes, yep. and he's saying, "Hi, <laughs> hey everybody. Oh, I'm a meat golem. Pl please kill me. Somebody, please kill me. Why did you give me life? I shouldn't exist. <laughs> I'm an abomination. God hates me." Yeah, let's just, we fuse it together, we'll use some, some ground beef as sort of the glue. To draw ground beef, just draw lumps and then like put little circles inside. That's uh, that's, 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 that's pretty good, yeah. That's a little bonus tip. That's a good tip. And yeah, we'll just, uh, we'll just sort of fuse our meat golem together with some beef. You can always count on Nathan for uh, hot beef drawing tips. Yeah. Like whenever I'm working on something and I can't figure out how to draw some beef, I come straight to Nathan and he just, he sets it right up for me. So, like. You, you should learn how to draw beef if you're going to have beef in all your articles. Which I am. Uh, check out my upcoming article, Top 10 Best Beef Types, that I ate last night. Uh, I thought that, that one was pretty good. I liked uh, your what, what Your Beef Type Says About You article. Yeah. Uh, your What Your Beef Type Says About You uh, expectation versus uh, reality. Yes, that was, that was a beef. pretty good one. And, beef uh, Spectations. Just gonna give him some uh, some bacon fingers. Oh, oh, good. So now he can grab hold of you. Yeah. <laughs> Come to me. Now, now he has the necessary implements to uh, to to exact vengeance to, upon his creators, yep. which is us. And uh, give him some like meat feet. Oh, meat feet. Those those are really gross. Those look like intestine feet. Yeah, they probably are. Well, um, guys. You're welcome for, you, you, for th your nightmares this is, tonight. Th this is uh this this has been drawn meat, you know, <laughs> to make it look appetizing. Always add some like sizzle lines, and um, you know, as always, don't don't listen to us, and uh, we're very sorry.